I start off with the good stuff. The good stuff to me is the pillow top itself. Then I go down to this part. I cut it. After that, I just start ripping it as I go. I get to a piece. I don't think I would be able to function every day if I didn't eat some quantity of rock. Teresa's favorite type of rock is a mixture of several minerals, including granite. She uses a hammer to break them up into bite-sized pieces. This is about the size I like it because um, it's not as hard to swallow. I would normally take a piece like this and normally just put it in my mouth or bite on it or just put the whole piece in my mouth. and. and get the earthy taste off of it. I will eat them in front of anybody. I'm not ashamed of it, so it doesn't really bother me. I eat it at home, of course, watching TV, movies, in my bedroom, driving down the road. I do eat more rocks when I'm nervous or upset. It does like bring me down and makes me feel more calm. I've eaten 12 remotes, over 5,000 beads, over 1,000 cocktail swords, 100 forks, about 10 water bottles, two pacifiers, three CD cases, about 50 hangers, about 25 plastic lids on to-go cups. Kaylin has eaten plastic every day for 11 years. Plastic is something I want and I feel like I need. She has consumed over 150 pounds of plastic and even chooses it over food. It's not the taste of plastic that I love. It's the way it crunches and feels and it's a rough but at the same time smooth texture to it. The texture of a remote control is one of her favorites. I'll take a button off and then I'll kind of like put it on each side of my mouth and then I swallow it. My name is Bria. I'm 19 years old and I'm addicted to eating sand. I just love the crunch. It's always good on top of food, like a seasoning or something. I've taken a tortilla chip, dipped them in sand, and ate them, and it gave the chip the best crunch that I've ever got in my entire life. My favorite combination of sand is when I mix it with gum. It's just like mouth-watering. Bria's addiction first developed five years ago when she accidentally got a mouthful of sand at the beach. She was instantly hooked on the crunchy texture. I eat it when I go to my room, when I'm walking to class, when I'm reading a book. Before I go to bed, I put like a pinch in my mouth. When I wake up in the morning, there's still pieces like in my teeth. It's like leftovers. Bria is so dependent on that satisfying crunch, she turns to nail files when her sand supply runs low. It has like sandpaper on it that gives me the same crunch. Sorry. Just put it like in the back of my teeth and just go like this. Wow, that's good. As it's going down your throat, it feels very nice and warm, almost like a thicker version of warm milk. But obviously, it's got that very strong chemical taste to it, which is perfect to me. <laughs> I drink paint from markers because I have looked for other paints, both in quart or gallon form, and haven't found any that satisfy my desire. When you get the marker, you need to shake it up, obviously. It's like your standard paint. You can already see that there is some white paint around the edge, so I'll put that into my mouth and suck the excess off, take that off. And now you have what I drink.
usually what I do is just store a lint roll in it. And sometimes hair be in there, and I have to pull it out. I should be able to lick it like that, and nothing get caught on my tongue. But he is ready to go. My name is Jennifer, and I'm addicted to eating mattresses. I like my mattress plain and straight up. I know mayonnaise, butter, <laughs> none of that. There's like a hard texture, like my taste buds to go, you know, kind of like, like a guitar. The reason why I'm not eating my own mattress is because I ate my mattress already. I start off with the good stuff. The good stuff to me is the pillow top itself. Then I go down to this part. I cut it. After that, I just start ripping it as I go. I get to a piece. I'm done with the mattress when it smells funny, or if I get down to where it's just the springs. I usually, when I crave to eat some mattress, it usually be after 2 o'clock after I eat. I, I'm urged. I need to urge. I got to have it. got to have it. For some reason, after sex, I would want some. <laughs>